pretty pretty shattered by to lose like that. Yeah. Especially after you know, yeah, a bit of a rough trot. Did you think it was the right decision, the right call? Oh, I'd have to have a look at it. Sums up your season, doesn't it? Season's not over yet. Were you happy with the changes you made tonight? Um, yeah, I thought I thought we uh, looked a lot more threatening different times. I think uh, Morgs had a couple of tries this day, um, so um, yeah, when we when we controlled the ball, I thought we looked pretty good at different times. What about Nari's performance? He got you know, muscled by English at one point and then came back. Oh, I think it was a credit to the kid because um, he, he he did. Yeah, you know, had a couple of errors there, um, and you know to see he, he didn't let it worry him. He got got himself back in the game, so I think that's a really good sign, good temperament from him. Um, so yeah, no, I was really, really pleased to see that. How's Matt Scott Green? Uh, hopefully, again, it's you know I don't like to speculate too much straight after a game, but it's hopefully it's not too bad. It's the same medial ligament, but it's the other knee. It's not his knee that he did last year, so hopefully it's not too bad. And we'll, we'll get scans tomorrow and confirm all that. Is the Maroons can't afford to lose any more, can they, first though? No, we can't afford to lose him. <laughs> He's a big part of our, our team. Uh, so co-captain of the club. Um, everyone looks uh, up to him, so it'll be a big loss for us. Is it a heartbreak for them? Yeah, it's pretty shattering. There's a lot of dejected boys in there, but um, it's a lot of positive signs from from tonight. Uh, changes that the, the coaches and staff have made, and um, we need to take that moving forward. It's heartening. You did play pretty well. You, you were up there with them the whole game. Oh, uh, well, probably beyond the eight ball from the, the get go, um, but I thought we played. Uh, showed some. Patience, uh, which we've probably lacked in previous weeks, and we got ourselves back in the game there, and um, we just couldn't ice it in the end. And um, like I said, there's a lot of dejected boys in there, but uh, I know one thing is they'll keep fighting. Do you think that form shows that all hope's not lost? You know, you are showing some heart in there, so you see it's still, it's still yeah, 100%. Yeah, 100%. We'll keep fighting. The squad that we got, coaching staff, the players. Mike Morgan's performance maybe showed that he's really not that far off where he was at the end of last season. Yeah, he was correct for us tonight. Um, big Tom or George or whatever come through the line there and one on one on one, like 120 kilos, and he's sat him on his rear end. So he um, was good on both sides of the ball. Um, it was probably more about how we get Tamari more involved. Um, I think uh, you know he uh, added spark. Or he in, in previous games when he gets on there, he sort of lifts the tempo of how he plays. So it was it was more about how we get him more, as I said, more involved. And I thought tonight he was good. He you know he, when he saw an opportunity, he called it, wasn't afraid to not, you know to call the ball. And you know I thought he was sharp. He kept him honest down that side. And, Puts himself in the game too. He's got a really good mouse for the game. Um, when there's something happening, he's never too far away. So, yeah, that was more my thinking about that. It's not so much, you know, playing more go fullback. It was more about, you know, I thought we were more of a threat with T out there as well. So you really persistent with that? Uh, but, look, I thought, I thought we showed some really good signs there tonight in attack. Um, you know, people have been pretty critical of us, so I thought it was a really good step in the right direction. Later on a couple of tries, so yeah, the stage, yeah, we'll probably stick with it. Yeah, he was, <laughs> he was good, Frank. He, you know, his first carry, he had the, the flick pass out the back, wasn't afraid to, you know, when you see that, it, it's it's good. He's, he's playing in the moment, you know, he's not, not overthinking what he does. I thought he added, again, added a bit of energy when he got out there. Uh, so I was really pleased for him. It's a great story. You think it's worth assisting with it? structure of the team as it was tonight? Yeah, yeah. We definitely got the game plan and, and the structures in place to, to win games, so it's important that we uh, don't shy away from that and uh, we, we believe in that. The 
hard though, really making that call. I guess two guys that have been a cornerstone of the side for four or five years, and like, was that the toughest part oh, of the job? Yeah, that's probably, that's probably the worst part of my job. Yeah. You know? Um, but at the end of the day, I've got to make the decision what a, what myself and the, the other coaching staff believe is what's best for the team at the, at the time. Um, and sometimes, you know, you know, you've got to drop guys for them to find a bit of form. Or, um, you know, we had to we had to win tonight, and you know, I picked the team that what, what we thought was our best chance, given what's been happening. So, but you're right, it's it's a tough part of the job. I don't, no one enjoys that. Yeah, we've just got to uh, kick on from tonight. Um, showed some great patience to get ourselves back in the game. Uh, we're behind the on the scoreboard all, all, all night and got ourselves back in front there towards the end and just couldn't ice it. So we need to learn from that. But you know, there's a lot of positive signs with the way that we played, the patience that we showed. Um, the structures that we put in place, I thought we executed really well. Probably a couple of things we need to fix with our defence, um, but you know we need to take the good things out of tonight and, and move forward. And um, you know that's the challenge for us now, is, is, is Melbourne and get back in, in the saddle. And, and you know we're on again next week, so um, the boys will, will fight to the end. That's for sure. Thanks, Thanks guys. Thanks, boys.